Hey guys, what's up? Uh, my name is Jan. This here is my pal Sub Sebastian, and our host today is Mr. Reimer. What do you got for us today? Well, we're going to cook a simple pasta dish using pasta, mm -hmm. some chili, some garlic, and some sausages. Ooh, yum! How do we make it? Uh, first thing we're going to do is we're going to get the water started. So the water's already started boiling, so we can get the pasta on as quickly as we can. And the next thing we're going to do is we're going to start chopping up the, the sausages. Can you use any kind of sausages or just one Pacific sausage? Good question. Uh, we usually use chorizo sausages, but today we're just going to use beef sausages. And actually, the, uh, the original recipe uses prosciutto, so you can use any kind of meat, really. Okay, shall we get started? Yes, yeah, so we'll just grab a sausage and we'll grab a, a knife. So we'll just go and cut down across it. Try to keep them as thin as possible because it, it'll brown a lot easier. So we'll do that with all three sausages. Who taught you how to cook this dish? Oh, this was my wife's recipe. Do you have any funny cooking stories you have to share with us? I'm pretty known for putting in the wrong amounts of salt into uh, specific dishes. Uh, one Christmas I was supposed to make the rice, and the rice called for a teaspoon of salt, and I put in a tablespoon of salt, and we didn't eat that rice that day. Now while he's doing that, we'll put some oil into the um, frying pan, just using olive oil. Put a little bit in there. This is going to help the sausages brown quicker. And then we'll turn it on a medium heat. You don't want to go too high. If you start going too high, it'll start splashing everywhere, and you don't want that. I know how it feels to get oil splashed on you. It yeah. hurts. <laughs> so, Mr. Rama, who does the most cooking in the house? Oh, my wife does most of the cooking. What are your favorite dishes to cook? Oh, I like cooking steak on the barbie. So, yeah. you're sort of like a barbecue man. I love the barbecue. All right, so now what we'll do is we'll just take these sausages and we'll just put them in the, in the frying pan. You want to make sure they're brown on both sides, but you don't want them burnt. Well, what is the main ingredient in all this, in um, this dish? Most, in most of the dishes I like, the main ingredient is the garlic. Because the garlic is what brings out all the flavor. I love garlic. I prefer like having like more spice in mine than garlic. I like mine spicy. Yeah, which is what we can do with this dish. Um, there's two types of chilies we use at home. We use the, the big red chilies and we use the baby hot chilies. If you want a spicier dish, then use the baby hot. And then you can keep the seeds in it as well. And that'll make it a lot spicier. What's next? So we'll use the tongs and we'll just keep these rotating around so that they don't burn on one side. And then while we're doing that, we're going to grab these red chilies. I've already sliced one open. And we like to take the seeds out, but like I said, Jared, if you like them hot, keep the seeds in it. And then we'll just throw these all into there. Beautiful. We'll put the top on. And all you need to do, Jared, if you'd like to do it, is just keep pulling on it. And then we'll chop it as you go. Yep, the faster you go, the harder it chops. Perfect. Okay, so there, look, it's all nicely chopped. Yum. What we'll do is we'll take three cloves of garlic. So what I like to do with the garlic is to get the skin off, is I usually just put my knife down like this. Yeah. And you just crush it enough so that it just falls off. Shall we check the water? Yes, let's check the water, make sure it's uh, gone. It's boiled. Okay, it's yep. starting to boil. Oh. Watch out the way I put this over here. And then we'll open these up and just pour it in. Do you want to open those up and pour it in? If you wanted to use the garlic press, Ooh. and put the garlic into that. Ooh. Perfect. Yep, just put it all in. Good, yeah. So what do we do with the garlic and chili? What we're going to do is, we're going to drain some of the oil out of this so that we don't have a lot of oil in the sauce. And then we're going to add all of that, plus the can of diced tomatoes. Ooh, and we'll add some salt and pepper to it. And then we're just going to let it cook for a bit. How long did this dish take to cook? About 25, about 35, 40 minutes. Ooh. All together. We'll open this up. Okay, so we'll just add the diced tomatoes to it. Yummy. Okay, so we'll take this. And spoon. Just spoon it all in. Boy. So that's, once that's done, we'll just put all the salt and pepper in there. There's the pepper. And then just add a little bit of salt. So what we'll do is we'll just watch this cook. We want to stir it frequently so it doesn't burn. burn and stick to the pan. And then it's just a waiting game. Once it's ready, we'll just put it all together in the bowl and 
Enjoy. Is it time to dish up now? Yeah, so what we'll do is we'll grab the pasta. Bring this over. Oh. Gimme. We'll just bring that here. Yeah, yep. Good job, Jared. We'll take the sauce and just pour it on top. Just keep fixing it. There you go. Hmm. Never had this before. Hmm. Okay, I recommend this dish. This is really good. Okay, thank you for joining us today, Mr. Rama. This dish was delicious, and I hope you have a good day. Thanks, Jared. Thanks, Sam. And I recommend this dish because it is really good. And I got to hang it too. It's pretty good. Thanks, Sam. <laughs> thank you, and good night. Bye.